making a backup administrator account on your PC. Hi everyone, Leo Notenboom here for AskLeo.com. This tip is actually something that I kind of backed into the other day when someone was asking about someone they had seen create a second administrator account on their machine and wondered why. The short answer is having a second administrator account on your machine that you don't normally use, perhaps even a local account, is something that can act as a backup should you ever lose access to your primary login account. Given that your primary login account is often a Microsoft account, of course there's the risk that that could get hacked. That could, of course, prevent you from accessing your account online, but there's a real risk that it could also prevent you from logging into your machine. Having an active backup administrator account on your machine would allow you to get back in and hopefully start to repair the damage. Let me show you how that's done. We start by firing up the settings app and going to accounts. So there you can see I have my primary account on this machine. What I want to do is add an account and that would be family and other users. What we want to do is add someone else to this PC. We'll click on that. Now, even though it says Microsoft account across the top of the dialog, what we really want is a local account. I'm going to call it backup admin. The reason I want a local account is because I don't want any dependency on online services. I want to be able to log into this machine regardless of whether it's even connected to the internet and having a local account that is completely disconnected from Microsoft is the way to do that. Uh, we'll go ahead and set a password. I'm using a short one just because of speed. You would normally type in something longer. We do need security questions, so I'm going to go ahead and answer those, and I'm going to answer them wrong and hit Next. Now we'll click on the newly created account and make sure it becomes an administrator account. And now we have a backup admin local account. We can sign out. And we'll see that Backup Admin is here and available for us to log in as. We'll go ahead and type in its password, confirming that we got it right, and let it go through the first time account setup. At this point, we have a Backup Admin account on our machine. And should we ever lose access to the primary account, we've always got another way in. To go back to our normal usage, we once again would sign out, select the normal account, and sign in again. Now we've always got that backup administrative account should we ever need it.